They say the eyes are a window to the soul, but what you really see when you look into someone's eyes is the state of their health. If you know what to look for, you can learn something about how a person is feeling, if they're sick, and even if they're at risk of losing their sight. Like most other mammals, humans have what's known as a camera type eye. It works just like a film camera to focus images through a lens onto a light-sensitive membrane called the retina. Messages from the retina are sent via the optic nerve and are interpreted by the brain. There are myriad things that can go wrong with these key components in the eye, but there are three main players that you'll hear about. Glaucoma, age-related macular degeneration, and cataracts. Cataract, which is a clouding of the natural lens of the eye, is the biggest cause of reversible blindness worldwide. Early signs include blurred vision, glare from car headlights, and difficulty reading. If you wear glasses, your prescription may keep changing within a short space of time. For some people, their prescription is affected so much that they can often read without spectacles, something that they have not been able to do for years. This is the phenomenon of second sight, but it's not everlasting. Untreated, cataracts will cloud your vision until there's little left. Of all the conditions that will make you go blind, we know the most about cataracts. Early cataract surgery involved extensive wounds in the eye, which often needed periods of immobility. Even today, some patients imagine that cataract surgery involves removing the eye from its socket and placing it on the cheek. The truth is far less gruesome than that. Huge advances in technology mean that we now have micro-incision surgery, foldable lenses and phacoemulsification, all of which mean you don't have to wait to go effectively blind before we can treat you, and we can achieve fantastic results. Although we can't prevent cataracts, they can be treated and the blindness they cause is reversible. Glaucoma, on the other hand, is not. Once glaucoma has affected the vision, there's no going back. Glaucoma is sometimes called the silent thief of sight because it often develops with no pain and no symptoms until it is very advanced. Glaucoma often runs in families, so it's particularly important to have regular eye health checks if there is a family history of glaucoma. There are many different types of glaucoma, but all of them affect the optic nerve. This nerve conveys signals between the eye and the brain and enables you to see. The optic nerve is made up of 1.2 million nerve fibres. Bundles of these nerves start to die and this gradually causes loss of your peripheral navigating vision. We're not exactly sure what causes it, but what we do know is that we can slow down the disease by lowering the eye pressure. If it's caught early, then glaucoma can be treated and controlled. The best we can hope for is to preserve the sight you have left, but sometimes the disease is aggressive and all we can do is slow it down. The last of the big three causes of vision impairment is age-related macular degeneration. AMD is the commonest cause of blind registration in the UK. In AMD, there is death of light-sensitive receptors in the central retina. It causes distortion and blurred vision. It doesn't affect your peripheral vision, so you won't go completely blind, but it takes away your most useful sight blocking out the things you're trying to focus on. The chance of you having AMD is greatly increased by age, smoking, or if it has affected your parents or brothers and sisters. If your parent had AMD, you're 30 times more likely to be affected than someone without a family history. While you can't prevent these conditions, here are the most important steps you can take for your eye health. Firstly, have regular eye health checks especially if you have a family history of a particular eye condition like glaucoma or AMD. Don't smoke. Wear sunglasses to protect against harmful ultraviolet radiation from sunlight. And maintain a healthy diet that includes plenty of green leafy vegetables. If you're worried about any of these conditions, visit nuffieldhealth.com for more information or ask a question in the comments below.